Hello guys, welcome to this video. We are carrying on with the packing, moving, shifting, organizing theme for this video. Today is Saturday and I'm heading back up to Auckland to mum and dad's very shortly. I just need to pack up my car and go basically. But that is the thing, I need to pack my car and I am hoping to fit quite a lot in this car but I, mm, oh, let me show you what we've got going on here. So this is everything. <laughs> that I'm hoping to fit, plus my house plants, plus this random box of PlayStation games that my brother bought off Facebook Marketplace. And uh, yeah, I, I don't really know how well this is, um, this is gonna go. My car is packed, I didn't film it because it was a little bit chaotic, but I'm just filling in the gaps basically with whatever I can find. All the angles around here. I don't know, I'm gonna put you on the floor. Here we go. So I'm just gonna fill up a supermarket bag with clothes hangers. Issue being, I don't really know what I'm gonna do with all these clothes hangers because this wardrobe is huge. And my wardrobe at home is, no, it's just a normal size wardrobe. But then like, I don't wanna throw out the coat hangers. Like, I'm, oh, I'm not gonna throw them out, I'll give them to someone else. Eventually, I'm hoping to have a wardrobe like this again someday. Someday, well, definitely not in the near future. I don't know, is that hoarding? I don't know. You would have seen in my previous vlog that I took some things out of my wardrobe last time I went home. We've done another big cull out. So I come back on Monday and I'm only here for five nights. So this is just a few things to tie me over. My monstera just sit over there. So that wall, because I took the artwork down, just looks sad. I'm refusing to take these down until like the last night. You guys, if you've been around here for a while, remember these from my room at home when I was in high school. And then I took them to university to the halls with me and then I put them up here. They're not going to go up on the wall again. I've bought a photo album for them. So yeah, a little bit sad, but that's okay. I need to put this last bag in my car, go to the bathroom, hit the road. I have made it home. My parents are nowhere to be seen. I have no idea where they are. But let me just, since we're like, actually we're not in the garage anymore, I can kind of show you the state of this. Uh, this is, yeah. Yeah, great. So I need to unpack all my stuff, figure out what's going up to my room, what's going to go into storage. I think most of this stuff's on my bedroom, which kind of scares me because there's a lot of stuff. And my bedroom here is not as big as my bedroom in Hamilton. It's fine. It's all good. <laughs> My camera battery is flashing, I've not planned this very well, but anyway, that, that's everything out of my car. I don't know where to start with this. <laughs> my room is so small, it's not small, but it's like not the size of my room in Hamilton. Mum and Dad don't know this either, but I'm planning on not keeping this in my room. So that means I lose out on quite a lot of storage, because I'm going to bring my cupboard back from, like my rattan cupboard back from Hamilton and put it in here. I thought this was fully empty and it's so not empty. Guys, I apologize. I have not been filming much, but my wardrobe, it now has clothes in it. We've got the black and white jumpers, colored jumpers, and dresses. That is all I'm gonna put in there for now. I do have a few things that are in Hamilton, like maybe like 10 things in Hamilton to add to this once I actually move back next weekend. But this is the rest of my clothes, which need to go into these drawers. I'm really hoping that they're gonna fit. That's all I'm gonna say. <laughs> arrived for me while I was away in Hamilton just this last week. So I'm gonna try and open it without scissors. We have two boxes. These are both from Daniel Wellington. I have worked with Daniel Wellington in the past and they have so kindly gifted me these two little items which I'll show you guys in a second. I've been wearing Daniel Wellington watches now for mm, like two years I want to say. But they are amazing. My, actually my mum has one now too. I gave her one of mine and she absolutely loves it as well. So timeless and such good quality. The, they just look so sophisticated which is I actually have an Apple watch but I don't wear it anymore unless I'm exercising because I just prefer the look of these. Let me show you and then we can we can go from there. So in this little box we have She's beautiful. This gold bangle. So I do have this in, it just slides on your wrist, Ooh, like so. I do have this in rose, gold, and silver, but that was before I decided this year that I was gonna wear gold jewelry. So I've been hanging out to get one of these and I was literally just about to buy one. And then they're like, hey, can we see one too? I'm like, yeah, of course you can. So that is that. These are such good quality and so nice. Again, they just look so sophisticated. So hang on. Let me get the watch out and then we can look at them together. This is my everyday go-to Daniel Wellington. This one is exactly the same except the face on it is gold as well. I am obsessed with that. This ring is from them, which I bought myself for my birthday, which actually matches 
the gold bangle and it is such good quality so anyway why are they sending me these goods you may be asking well a they're very kind people and b because they are having a huge black friday sale called a black week and you can get up to 50 percent off the items on the website so obviously fave 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 i have many more faves as well and if you use my code emma stevens just my name no spaces all capitals pop on the screen for you um you can also get an extra 15 percent off the sale prices which is crazy insane and also perfect timing if you're thinking about buying christmas presents literally for yourself for your mum for your dad for your uncle auntie cousin boyfriend girlfriend husband whatever but i'll pop the details the link the discount code and stuff in the description box down below Oh, good morning guys. Literally sound like I've just been for a run, but no, I just walked up the stairs. This morning, we are doing some furniture rearranging. I'm currently in what was my brother's room, but it's now my dad's office. And this is also going to be my office when I move home, which I decided about 20 minutes ago. My brother's desk used to sit here, as you can see. It isn't there. It is now in the garage, but we live in a two-storied house. So how did I get it downstairs, you ask? If I can find it, I'll put in a clip from the security cameras in the carriage. But I decided this morning, because I came up with my Snapchat memories, it's a year ago since we put up our Christmas tree in the flat. Obviously we're not doing that this year because we'd only have it up for like a week and then we'd be moving. So, I'm moving this desk next door into Matt's room, or to Dad's office, my office, whatever you want to call it. And then I'm going to put my Christmas tree in this corner. How cute. I think when I actually move home, this corner will have like, you know, do you guys know the seats we have in our lounge? I think I'm gonna put one of them here, the Monstera, and I've got like a little rattan lamp also from Kmart. Now I think I'll put that all in this corner and make it like a little reading nook. Absolutely beautiful, fits like a glove, fantastic. Now I need to go to tell my parents what I've done. Good morning. Hi. Do you want to come see what I've done? Yeah, hang on. Must be good. What was there before? The blue desk. So where did you put the blue desk? It's in the garage. Oh. And then in here, I have a nice spot to put my Christmas tree. some of the screws really long and some of them really short and then upstairs for thinking realized that the long ones are going into studs and the short ones are just going to plasterboard there you go the more you know The space is clear and this feels so weird. I've been like, this is my bedroom that I've had since like day dot. So this corner has never not had furniture in it. And it looks really, really bizarre. Anyway, time to put up the Christmas tree. Hello guys, it is now the next day and I have just been to the dentist, which is... I have a lazy side of my face anyway, let alone when it's numb. Yesterday afternoon didn't vlog because Dad had all of his high school friends over, so that was fun, got to meet all of his high school friends. And they were around like six hours, so that was that. My Christmas tree up looks so good. I, I, I can't take myself seriously. I took a video last night when it was dark and I'll put that in now so you can see what it looks like with the pretty lights. I'm currently just been to the dentist. $470 later. I booked in this appointment like four months ago so I had enough time to save up for it. Off to Hamilton now for the rest of the week. My last week in the flat. So the next video you guys see from me will be me actually moving out of the flat which is crazy. But stay safe, <laughs> stay well and make someone smile. <laughs> see you later. Morning sunshine. Hi.